Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I will tell you how to set up uploading new contacts from Zoho CRM to Active Campaign. This is necessary in order to automatically transfer new contacts from Zoho to other systems. For example, in Active Campaign you can create new contacts, conveniently store, process and interact with them in every possible way in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next you need to select the Zoho CRM data source system. Next, you need to choose an action. Get contacts, new. Next you need to connect your Zoho CRM account to the Apex Drive system. In this window we need to specify the username and password of the Zoho personal account. You also need to grant Apex Drive permission to work with your Zoho account. When the connected login is displayed in the list select it. No additional settings are provided for the Zoho system, so just click continue. At this stage, you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click continue. At this stage, you see data for one of your contacts. If everything suits you, click next. This completes the setup of the Zoho CRM data source successfully. Now you need to go to the data reception settings. Select Active Campaign as the data receiving system. Next, you need to select an action. Add contact. At this stage, you need to connect your Active Campaign account to the Apex Drive system. In this window, you must specify the API domain and API key. In order to get this data, go to your Active Campaign account. Then go to Settings. Developer. Copy the URL and key and paste them into the appropriate fields in the Apex Drive system. When the required fields are filled click Save. When the connected login is displayed in the list, select it. At this stage, you need to select a list in which new contacts will be created for each new contact from Zoho CRM. Now you see the active campaign fields to create a new contact. You can assign variables from Zoho CRM to these fields. In order to do this, click in the field and select a variable from the drop-down list. When all the required fields are filled, click Continue. At this point, you see an example of the data that will be sent to Active Campaign as new contacts on a new contact from Zoho CRM. If something does not suit you, click Edit and go back a step. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Active Campaign. After successful submission, go to Active Campaign and check the result. If everything suits you, return to the Apex Drive service and continue setting up. This completes the configuration of Active Campaign data reception successfully. Now you need to enable auto update and select the communication interval, for example, once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.